We've never been happier to welcome the newest members of the iCarly Nation. Welcome and welcome back everybody to the number one home for film and television lovers everywhere. Today we're taking a look at the fresh faces of the iCarly revival and what they have to say about the soon to be released sitcom. I put your warm milk in your thermos next to your bed. So are we done here? Ever since the reboot was announced, we've heard whispers about the two newest members of the cast, Lacey Mosley and Jaden Triplett. More recently, the two finally got to speak about their experiences and hopes for the new series while dishing out the latest information about their characters Harper and Millicent. Jaden's a young actress with an acting and music background that stems from her multi-talented family, while Lacey's an improv-trained comedian, podcaster, and actress whose wit and skills have landed her spots on critically acclaimed productions like HBO's A Black Lady Sketch Show. But how do these stars feel about iCarly? Did they get along with Miranda Cosgrove on their first day? Which character did they relate to the most? Let's find out! If you're a film and television lover and you're losing your mind over the new iCarly revival, then try and stay sane by subscribing to our channel and joining the iCarly countdown. Now let's get to it! We're probably not the only ones who were curious to see what the new iCarly castmates had to say about joining one of the most iconic and influential kids series ever. Luckily, the stars felt just as excited as the rest of us, and if these recent interviews are anything to go by, they're loving their time on set and beyond. Jaden Triplett, who plays Freddie's stepdaughter Millicent, may only be 10 years old, but she eloquently described her cool character by saying, My character's definitely ambitious. She's a hard worker and she's strong-willed. The crew and cast called me the baby <laughs> because I am the youngest. Jaden touched on Millicent's personality, calling her social media obsessed and someone who always has her phone on her. Well, if anyone will connect to the Gen Z gang, it's young Millicent. Freddie's daughter seems to have taken after her dad in that one aspect, being internet and tech savvy. In the original series, Freddie was the technical nerd behind the iCarly web show. He was a cameraman, sure, but he also took care of the behind-the-scenes stuff like algorithms and analytics. We see Millicent as someone who's hip to modern terms like SEO and keywords. We're sure she gets it from her stepdad. But what other characteristics do the two share? According to Jaden, they share their crazy ideas. Jaden reflects on her screen stepdad, calling his life pretty crazy, mostly because he is, quote, handling a lot with adulthood and Carly in general because she's all over the place. Like, I just got out of bed and was all, oops, I just blazed a trail. She also commented on Freddie's newfound reality as a dad. She says, having to become a dad is definitely a lot for him. But based on the episodes we've done, he's a really good father. Well, isn't that sweet? The two seem like they might get along great eventually. Jaden has also revealed that the pair have a love-hate relationship, mostly due to the instant dad factor and all of the changes in their life. She also commented that Millicent isn't the easiest to deal with, but she hints at a full-on daddy-daughter relationship as the series progresses. We cannot wait to see that. Get your tissue boxes ready. Another tale that's just as heartwarming as the last is Jaden's constant gushing about her new co-stars. The youngster revealed that she had been binge-watching the first seasons of iCarly on Netflix a week before she got the audition call for the revival series. Isn't that serendipitous? You know, it just adds like a more well-rounded part of it, you know? She also revealed that she had fallen in love with the wild world of Bushwell Plaza and that it was surreal stepping onto the Shea apartment set after seeing it on TV. Fans of the series will remember the giant gummy bears, ice cream sandwich seats, and bottle bot from the first season. But they might realize that the set is different from the original one located at Nickelodeon on Sunset. Unfortunately, that building, which also housed part of the Victoria set, was demolished. But the new set has so many of the original features that you can barely notice the difference. That wasn't the only mesmerizing aspect of the process either. Jaden describes her first time meeting Miranda Cosgrove as magical. She says, I was so nervous because for the chemistry reading, I got to meet Miranda Cosgrove for the first time and that was just so cool because she was the kindest person ever. And how she tries to keep up um, making iCarly in a new way. Jaden also says she's learned a lot from her castmates, even though she's such a young actress. She defines herself as an official fangirl of the original, who got to see the cast in a more intimate light after being cast. She giggles about the many pranks Jerry Trainer and Nathan Kress play on her, though it's all in good fun. Jaden reminisces about Jerry putting her scripts on the top shelf, only to cave after she gives him puppy dog eyes. We all know that Spencer is the king of pranks, but Jerry clearly has a soft spot for kids. We're glad these two have such sweet chemistry. Jaden isn't the only one gushing over her co-stars. Lacey Mosley recently spoke about her experiences on the new show and though some negativity crept up with some internet trolls, Lacey is all smiles today. She never really saw their parents. Um, 
<laughs> so there was no one to get in the way of their fun, unfortunately my parents. She has gained a new friend in Miranda Cosgrove, who she showered in birthday wishes and called a fast work friend on May 14th. She let fans know she was a big fan of the series way before she was cast. While answering questions about how she used to relate to the show, she said, I'm in the same age range as Nathan Kress and Miranda Cosgrove, and I watched the show growing up. She fondly remembers the shenanigans that the team went through. She also reflected on the fresh-faced iCarly that invites different perspectives and backgrounds, saying, What's great about this new version of iCarly is that if you watched it and were the same age as the original characters, you're getting to see all of these people grow up. She also quips about the millennial experience and the dissolution most millennials like her and the characters felt after college. Lacey has been pretty vocal about her experiences as a young woman of color in the acting and entertainment industry, and this will be a huge platform for her to hilariously tell the story of millions of women just like her. The iCarly world really is getting bigger. It's not even a nation anymore, it's a universe, and it's one we're part of. We're totally here for the new cast members and we can't wait to see them do their thing come June 17th. The first three episodes will be airing simultaneously, so set your calendars and cook up some spaghetti tacos in anticipation. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and give us a big thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more cool content just like this. See you in the next one.